How are you doing? My name is Joseph Charles Kong. View modern art. And this is the Connor McGregor painting. I have it right here. It's 10 by 10. It's like the Mayweather one, 10 by 10. About the same size. The price in the title is the price in the title. I'm not going to mention the price. Because sometimes I do change my mind, but I highly doubt. Right now, you'll probably see it at $77,000 for this. And noon by the next day, it goes up another 77000 every single day till the end of time. Now, this fight is a week away. It is the biggest fight in history. It's the most money in history in in a fight we're talking about a hundred million and a hundred million in the pay-per-view and everything's in the millions so what's this why do i think these paintings are going to be worth something because this is the biggest fight of the century and this fight will go on for a long time people will be talking about this fight so next week when I do my actual fight piece of art, that will be the seconds after that fight is done, I will cam my piece of art on canvas to represent that fight and that will be $77,777 every single day till the end of time. Now, L O A. Connor McGregor believes in L O A. I'm not going to explain to you what it is. I'm not going to bore you with that. But I believe in L O A. What is L O A? Search it out yourself. I'm not going to. I'm not going to. I'm not going to explain it because he believes it and I believe it and this war paint this art should not exist should not exist if you told me I was going to be doing this two years ago I'd say you're crazy if you told me three or four years ago that I'd be a YouTuber and I would be posting stuff up onto YouTube, I'd say impossible. I believe LOA has a lot to do with that. And I believe that this painting I'm about to do, I believe it exists because of LOA. Connor McGregor believes in LOA and so do I and I believe I don't know who's going to win the fight but if he believes in his mind that he's going to win and he visualizes it and just this war paint this art war paint and art only exists because of LOA I thought long and hard to include include LOA in this and it's it's the truth I with my war paint and the canvas piece art should not exist and LOA brought me there it brought me there I believe it I really do well this fight's going to be talked about for a long time, and I want art to be born from two warriors, from a warrior artist. I'm a renegade in the art world. People say, Chuck, you're a renegade. Like, you can't price your stuff like that. You can't do this. You can't do that. Why not? Why can't I do what I want to do? People criticize my stuff. People, but... A lot of the people that have been criticizing lately do agree on this. Do agree on this. So, to Mayweather and McGregor 
from one warrior to you guys. If I don't know if you'll ever ever see this art. If you'll ever see this art. It's possible. If it gets world attention, it's very possible. So and this is where it gets uh Let's do it. Let's do it. There's no talk. Let's get it done. Um, there's the part that uh, scares me. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. I'm painting with my face, guys. This one is... Wow. Just got to match up what I'm doing. I'm painting with my face, guys. Is that done? I know you want to see it. Just a little bit red in there make it redder why why not that looks good guys McGregor what does that look like guys very nice I like that one a long good look at it um i think it might be one of my best ones wow that looks good connor mcgregor you believe in loa and so do i and you and i if we believe then the outcome should be should be a win I hate to I don't want to really say that right now because it should be a win it should be um the reposition the camera to do wow that looks good to do the I have it upside down to do the stamp in the middle now thanks for watching uh hang on a second while i pause this uh i've been put on my glasses so i don't screw up the pause hit the wrong button connor mcgregor um so here's the center now i hope this all goes well Uh, I'm actually going to ink this really good and make sure there's lots of ink on here for my middle part. Um, this fight's going to be a history changer. Like, there's people that watched my last video and they didn't even know. There's people that didn't even know there was a fight coming. Like, that's funny. Like, the biggest fight of the century, and maybe some people don't care. Okay, hopefully, I'm going to make sure this is right in the middle. It's not... It's not perfect, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's perfect, because it's a piece of art. Uh, just give me one second. I'm going to clean this off, but I'm going to pause it. So basically, this is what it looks like. Just have the backing stuff. So I, I like this one. I like this one. Uh, hopefully, you could see that. Uh, maybe if I put it up here. Yeah. 
I'll put it in a couple spots here so just I like this this side uh, when you've seen if you look at the one side of my face there it uh, it's the tattoo uh, basically of Connor McGregor the tattoo on his chest that's what I was doing the thing is um, there's a reason why I didn't do it on both sides and you'll see that next week you might have figured it out by now but uh, if you watch the other video in this one you probably figured it out if not you'll see next Saturday seconds after the fights done I'll make my piece of art and I'll post it as soon as I possibly, humanly possibly can. Now, like I said, this fight is huge. It's a huge fight. Uh, maybe I'll put it a little further just because I can't judge one by the camera. So, um, it's a big fight in history. That's all there is to it. And the price, well, this price is the biggest in history. So why shouldn't there be pieces of art for the biggest in history? I got one now for Mayweather and one for McGregor. Um, Floyd Mayweather is 58 and 59 is Connor McGregor. And then 60 is the fight. Um, what can I say? What can I say? What else can I possibly say? The price, 77, when you really think about it, what's 77,000 times, what's 77,000 times 365? You're only looking at maybe 20 plus million dollars. Now people say, there's no way in hell. You'll, and I said, you know what? All this needs is a little... Um, media attention. All this needs is is all my other smaller works to be sold so for people to talk about. So this might not sell today, might not sell next month, next year, 10 years from now. But I believe in my heart someday this will sell at the 77,000 every single day and next weekend is going to be 77,777 dollars every single day we're not talking about a year down the road and somebody wants to buy this at 77,000 it doesn't work like that it's 77,000 times how many days from the when this was born it's that simple um, whether people take it seriously or not, it doesn't matter. The matter is, what matters is my art that is on your wall. My art, my price is part of my art. My art is the war paint on canvas. My art is the canvas, that, the, the way it's done. It's the social media, it's connected with that that's when you're looking if this was on your wall say you bought this for 77,000 it was on your wall you know the artist me wants all my stuff to go up every single day and one of the reasons why I want that is because I want people that own my art to say you know what I have I can sell this in the future you know I don't know only time will tell. I'm a, I'm, nobody knows who I am. But there's people starting to know who I am. I'm starting to get people talking about it. I even had one art, apparently one art critic saying that it's a brilliant thing, but the price is just not brilliant. It's, it's unrealistic and everything. And this is only like a maybe at tops a $300 painting kind of thing. Whatever. I don't think so. In time, if you have this on your wall or any of my other pieces of art on your wall, I want to be known as the renegade war painted guy that his art on your wall goes up every single day. Okay? The day, two days today, tomorrow's another day. And yesterday is gone. But the price 
today always goes up. What else can I say? How can I convince you? I can't. Can't convince you. Next week is on 12th and... Uh, where did I put my... Should I show you the next week's now? No. I have my 12 by 12. But I'm not going to show you that now. Um, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Any comments? Just leave the comments. Good or bad, it doesn't matter. The matter is in the future, I will be a known artist. It'll just take some time. And this is a very good one. This is a very good one. It's, it's, it's a little... A little it's a little crooked in the middle there, but that's okay. Thank you so much for watching. Joseph Charles Call, View, Modern Art, Connor McGregor. Thank you.